Howdy Pokemon trainers and welcome to Pimon 5. We have very little time so let's see how fast we can get through this. Today we're going over Execute and Executor. I don't really understand these Pokemon but I'll try my best, starting with Execute. This Pokemon is a little bit confusing to me. After all, it's six individual Pokemon. All of these Pokemon are either broken, rotten, or disheveled eggs in some sort. After all, each of them kind of are either abandoned, broken, or just left to be. I don't know how they survive in such condition, but they tend to have extreme power and once they find each other, never leave each other's side. As I said with extreme power though, it's mainly psychic, psychic power, being able to move things with your mind if you don't understand. But when it comes down into a battle, there are six individual eggs. They're not exactly strong, but they have a hypnotic power that even Ash has been witness to. Actually, Ash has been victim to. Now with that said, it's on to Executor. This Pokemon is where I start getting confused. We had six eggs, yet only three heads on this Pokemon. Which kind of confuses me because there are six eggs within Execute. Well, you also have to consider that Execute is also a palm tree that sprouted from a bunch of eggs. I don't understand how this is physically possible, but at the same time, it's Pokemon, so it doesn't really need to make sense. After all, some fan art just draws extra heads going around the edge of Executor. I found one of them for this example. I think it looks relatively fine even giving each head its own emotion. But when it comes down to overall power in a battle, leave it to Executor to hypnotize, hypnotize its opponents and make it attack itself instead of it. A little bit overpowered, but I wouldn't say it's the best idea. When it comes down to stats though, it's all about that special attack. Not really high scores and anything else. Moves? Well, you have Hypnosis. You also have a few grass type moves, such as Sleep Powder. Generally, you can find Solar Beam with in Executor, but at the same time, it's kind of a relatively small move pull. But when it comes down to the fun fact, I'm kind of backtracking here. You've all heard how Execute is made out of six individual eggs. Well, each of those eggs are from a rotten or underdeveloped or non-hatched Pokemon egg. So think of it this way. Each Execute is six eggs that refused to hatch, went bad, or weren't properly taken care of. Which means they could have each been individual Pokemon that could have served a much better purpose than trying to hypnotize innocent trainers just trying to earn gym badges. I'm talking about you, Ash. That's all the facts for now. If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to be notified of all my future videos, and have a great rest of your day.